Now, here's meteorologist T.J. Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. So the rain has returned. It's going to be around this evening. Then we'll have some drier weather, it looks like, for a couple of days, but it's going to remain unsettled for the next seven days. Here's the live Pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. We're examining the skies over southern Rhode Island. And you can see we've got showers in the Providence area through Kent County, down through Westerly, some showers out on Block Island. We're going to be in and out of the showers through much of the evening. Threat tracker for tonight, Sunday, Monday. Low chance of anything severe, but yeah, we're dealing with more rain this evening. Live pictures from Narragansett, some pretty decent waves down here. Saw somebody with a jet ski down here actually earlier in the afternoon. Temperature 58 degrees, relative humidity is high, wind from the southwest at 6, gusting to 14. In Cumberland, we had a wind gust of 31 miles an hour in, earlier in the afternoon. It's 59 degrees right now, and in North Kingstown, 57 degrees. They had a gust of 24. You can see in the satellite radar picture, we've got this plume of moisture continuing to come in off of the Atlantic Ocean, associated with this big circulation centered back here off to our west. This is going to be more or less stuck for the next few days and as a result we're looking at some unsettled weather and the unsettled weather will likely continue into a portion of next week. Let's take a look at this with our future cast. Here we are 8 o'clock this evening with this plume of moisture continuing to come in off of the Atlantic Ocean. Look at the chance of rain showers so about 11 12 o'clock this evening and then we are going to be seeing some partial clearing late in the night 8 o'clock tomorrow morning morning. We'll have some sunshine, but notice during the afternoon there could be a few rain showers out across southeastern Massachusetts. I think we'll be looking at a blend of clouds and sunshine here in Rhode Island. Maybe a quick shower tomorrow night and then Monday we are going to be seeing a blend of clouds and sunshine once again. Looks like it'll be a mainly dry day on Monday. So your forecast for your Sunday morning temperatures climbing back through the 50s, getting up to about 60 degrees during the uh, midday. Let's pinpoint the afternoon well, the coastline with the wind off the water, a little bit cooler, drier conditions down here. Northern Rhode Island, low 60s in Providence, Johnston, West Warwick, Cranston and Warwick. Over in southeastern Mass, again over here, better chance for some rain showers during the afternoon, upper 50s to lower 60s. Here's the live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast. Tomorrow morning, we've got the Providence Marathon kicks off at 730 downtown. Temperatures kind of cool, good running weather, a little bit of sunshine, dry around 9 o'clock, 11 o'clock in the morning, about 60 degrees, continued dry weather. Monday, we are going to be seeing some sunshine, a little cooler though, temperatures in the mid 50s during the afternoon on Monday. And then there's that unsettled weather Tuesday, Wednesday, and into Thursday with some occasional showers. Tough to time the exact time that those showers will be arriving, but you get the picture. We are looking at some occasional showers those three days, maybe dry Friday, looking at the chance for some more showers next Saturday and potentially on Mother's Day, we could be looking at an all day rain. That's a long way away, something that we are monitoring, however. Okay. It's just, I'm a bearer of wonderful news tonight. I have no words right now, and we were also time constrained, but we'll talk about <laughs> it later. Coming up in sports, Eyewitness News at 6. The Red